Hey folks, welcome to our Icon Scout channel. This is Nishi here, and in this video, I'm going to show you how you can bring assets from the Icon Scout plugin into your Figma design file. As designers, how many of you are tired of listening to the make your design pop feedback? Well, I know I have. With the Icon Scout plugin, you can make your design pop by not just using illustrations and lotties and icons from one of the largest marketplaces, but you can do that in just a few minutes. Let me show you how. Now, let us consider that you are working on a website mockup, something like this, and need some icons and illustrations to spruce up your design. I feel like an animation over here on the first fold will look just great. For that, open up your plugin by right clicking and choose plugins and then the icons card plugin once the plugin is open just type in whatever you're looking for in the search box over here in this case i think i'm going to look for something like yoga and choose animations from here as you can see there are lots and lots of animations for you to choose from i think i really like this one over here once you find the animation that you like just drag and drop your animation to where you want it to be and that's it. Now let me just quickly recompose it. And done. Now let us do the same for some illustrations. Just navigate to illustrations from here and repeat the process. But before we proceed, let's have a look at this illustration over here. Click on this little eye icon to open it up. You can see that you can look at the designer's profile from here and view all the assets that they have created. If you like a particular designer, you can even follow them. Once you hit follow, you can see that their logo pops up right here and this will allow you to jump to their page directly and choose whichever asset you like from their creations. Now let's head back to our yoga pack. Now instead of going back and looking for more illustrations, I'm just going to click on the view yoga pack so I can choose illustrations from the same pack. This will make sure that our visual style remains the same throughout and our design looks cohesive. Let me add a few more illustrations to my design. I'm going to repeat the same process. Choose what I like and then drag and drop it to my canvas. Now that we are done with our illustrations, it's time to add some icons. This section over here definitely needs a few icons. I think I'm going to go back and search for heart and navigate to icons from here. If you are looking for a particular style, you can use these filters here to search for the style you like. I think I want to look for line icons, so I'm going to choose the line style from here. I think I like this one a lot, so I'm just going to drag and drop it onto my canvas. But you can see that this time the icon is an SVG. But before anything else, I think I'm just going to change its color from black to green so it looks slightly more better. Um, maybe I'm also going to compose this slightly. You must have noticed that the vector has come with its own frame. To fix that, I'm just going to drag my icon onto my current artboard, rename it and then delete the extra frame. And that's it. Now let us proceed to adding another icon. I'm going to look for strength this time and before dragging it to its position, let us change the color of the SVG even before downloading it. For that, let us copy the hex code of this green first. Now choose the color palette option from here. You can always use the existing palettes or you could create your own to match your brand color. But since we want our green, let us click here on the add button. Let's quickly rename our palette to green and click on the plus icon. Now paste the color code over here and hit apply. 
Make sure that you hit apply over here as well so that it's applied to all the icons. Just drag and drop the icon that you like and repeat the same steps as before. Now let me add two more icons to complete this design. And that's it. This is how easy it was to make your design pop. Well, I really hope that this was helpful. Feel free to drop any questions or comments that you may have and we will do our best to answer all of them. This is Nishi signing off. Thank you so much and have a wonderful day ahead.